Hello everyone, to, uh, welcome to the ERP Next Series number 21. Uh, today the topic is about the BOM uh, comparison tool and BOM update tool. Let's enjoy a video. Uh, today is the ERP Next topic and then we're gonna go to the very short uh, topic uh, about the bomb comparison and then bomb update tools. Uh -huh. Okay, so we go to the bomb comparison first. So uh, at this moment, uh, most of the people when you go to the bomb, I uh, I see the bomb list. Uh, we have the choice like the alternate item. Now, for example, when I want to build the Lego car, and then I found out that uh, in order to do the Lego car, I need to have the rechargeable battery. Now have this this item. Now have the rechargeable battery. And for some reason, this rechargeable battery maybe they they do not supply the product anymore. So I need to do the replacement. Now have so if you do the alternate item it's gonna be really really easy but sometimes you don't want to do alternate because uh, may maybe you will not really know whether the product that you are doing is is uh, they, they really short or not so maybe some people they don't want to use alternate items so what we do so what we do is we create a new bomb yes we create another another bomb so we go to the uh, bomb and then what you can do is you can uh, Okay, I gonna duplicate, uh, or actually I, I can just build any one, but I just duplicate. Uh, okay, so we gonna duplicate and then we have that same item. Uh, in order to produce, we have 10 items and then on the rechargeable battery, I just I just delete it. Uh, and then I add, uh, I add the, the another item. So this one you can, uh, I gonna add the AA battery box. Uh -huh, something like this. You know, sometimes you can reduce the stuff, you can repair the stuff. For example, uh, when you do the production, sometimes the part, two parts, they combine, you know, I mean, when, when you produce some product, right, and then one day the supplier made the phone call and said, hey, you didn't need two ships anymore, just one ship can do both, right? Uh, if you doing the computer stuff, right, you, you're gonna know that some CPU, they have built in the GPU, uh -huh, something like that. Okay, so I just said, so uh, and then just submit to do this one like the bomb so it's mean that what we gonna do is we gonna have the the uh, build of material of the two product that is the the cassette one one of them like that is the number two uh, number two that that we use the the uh, AA battery like and then we gonna have the number one that we use the rechargeable uh, the battery, right? something like this one. So what we're gonna do is very simple. We go to bomb comparison tool, right? and then the bomb number one of the product is the uh, mock this one, and then another one. You may wonder that why we can just put anything. Yes, because the computer, I mean, the system, they are not that smart, you know, they didn't know that uh, this, com uh, this two product is similar or not, you know, I mean, you can just have another two item that is look almost the same look identical but you record it as two item okay? okay so we do this one so they're gonna tell you that this one is a total card now what is the difference uh -huh. so you see number two have the lower card in the raw material okay? and then you you can you can do just uh, uh for for the operation as well but they didn't say operation right okay? they, they're gonna just you said uh, they're gonna say just the raw material card so this one is the one to do the comparison and then they are very smart. They gonna know that which row you add, which row is removed. Right? And then uh, they gonna do the the trying to to tell you right? that that which one is uh, which one is missing, which one is uh, which one is uh, uh, added. Right? Okay, so the bomb comparison tool is very good. But if you try to put something that is not related, so it will not make any sense, you know. <laughs> so it's been remove everyone and then just add everyone. So you do not do the bomb comparison for the non-similar one because the report will not make any sense. Okay, so the next one right, have is the bomb update tool. It means sometimes you find out that the old one you will never make it anymore because we have the new product already. Right? So I mean new part already. So you, you can just replace right, the bomb with this one. Right? Okay, so you just click replace. 
นะครับ Q for replace bomb บาบาบาบา so when you replace it what happen นะครับ so the what happen is very simple if uh, anything in the work order and then you haven't do the uh, haven't do the any uh, any uh, let's say you haven't do the production jet they gonna update นะครับ but if you if you do ah uh, here นะครับ this one three car set นะครับ and then and then come นะฮะโอเค this one is the the bomb this one I I haven't okay so maybe I just I attempt to manufacture I just want to here and then I just want to save ฮะโอเค so this one is become zero zero uh, bomb is zero zero one right before นะฮะโอเค so maybe I if I do another work order นะฮะ in here นะ and then I want to make the three car set นะฮะ Okay, and then bomb. This one is bomb zero zero one, right? Uh, and then I save. I will not. I will not quantity manufacturer. Maybe I just set two. Okay, I I I I will not. I will not submit it. I can save because I want to list the product. Uh -huh. Okay. So when we when we start and then list the product, you gonna notice that ah huh? how come it's become a, a battery box already? Yeah, because even though you said bomb number one. Because you replace already, you no longer had bomb number one and uh, I mean the old, uh, the old one, นะครับ Okay, so when I go back, but when I go back to the complete one, you said bomb number one, right? And then in the bomb number one, it's still rechargeable. Why? Because you finish product for this thing already, so it's gonna be rechargeable. It's gonna be the old one. You cannot come back and then change the history, นะครับ But for the one you have window. Uh, you have window, even though you said what zero zero one is gonna be the uh, nah, okay. So this one I, I I do it before, right? Uh, I show you the one that I haven't have window. Nah, the one that I haven't do, even though I, I said the bomb number one is gonna be something like the the. Uh, this one is the item. Nah, sorry, I just come to the work order. Nah, okay. Is uh, this one is the the this one should be the only one, right? I just come to the work order and then I try to create the one. I have the mark even though it's the bomb. Ah, oh, okay, they change to bomb number two already. Now and then it's gonna be I say one time in order to arrange. Here we are. One, two, three. Okay. Here. Yep. Uh -huh. And then it's gonna be the AA battery. Uh -huh. So you will no longer see the bomb uh, 001. Uh -huh. It's gonna replace uh -huh. Some, something like that. Uh -huh. Okay, so this one is the, the bomb that I haven't, haven't start. Uh -huh. have haven't start yet. Uh -huh. Okay, and yeah, this one is gonna be AA battery box. Yeah, even though I, I haven't uh, started yet. Uh -huh. Okay, so this one, if you submit, they're gonna just submit to that one uh -huh. so the bomb comparison tool and the update tool is very useful uh -huh. but if you use the bomb update tools uh -huh, please make sure that uh, they will please understand that they will never change the history data uh -huh. okay so maybe uh, in order to make it you may just just uh, create a new bomb and then just set it uh -huh. you you can set it Directly like this one, okay. So I said bomb here. Yeah. Okay. So we have this one, right? And then you set it to become the default one. Okay. You just set it default, and then the own one. If you don't want to 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 use it, Okay. I uh, I just want to here. Now, if you don't want to use it, you just set inactive. Just that. Uh -huh. So you didn't need to keep update. But if you want to update, please note that they're gonna update only the one who you have won have won start manufacturing. Okay, okay. So I think that's all for the topic. Uh -huh. So this one is very very small. Okay, thank you and bye bye. See you again next video.